Hello guys, let's see the question number 19. So a driver takes 0 0.2 second to apply the brakes after he see a need for it. This is called the reaction time of driver. If he is driving a car at a speed of 54 km per hour and the brakes cause a deceleration of 6 m per second square, find the distance traveled by the car after he see the need to put the brakes on. Well, in reaction time, the body moves with the speed of since the driver was sitting on the uh, like the whatever the car or truck, right? So, even if his body is moving with along with the car, so hence the body moves with the speed, body with the move with the speed of 50 km per hour. Let's convert the 54 km into meter per second by multiplying with 5 by 18 so we'll give you 15 meter per second right okay so well that's the constant speed well distance travel in the time is 15 into 0 0.2 why 0 0.2 because after the brakes are applied after the brakes are applied this takes 0 0.2 second to apply the brake sorry it takes 0 0.2 to apply the brakes so well that was the reaction time so before applying the brake the body moves around 3 meter along uh, just along the movement of the direction of the the vehicle when the brakes are applied now at that time the final velocity will be the initial velocity we know that that very easy concept we just find it into the meter per second square final velocity will become zero because finally it will come to waste as per the previous video you can watch the previous video that's very helpful for you and the acceleration will become deceleration now the a will become minus of 6 meter per second use the concept we'll know that the s is equal to this many formula right so v square minus u square upon 2a we, use, we just find it using this formula v square is equal to u square plus 2s okay got it so basically over total distance travel will be s1 plus s2 what about the s1 this s1 is before applying the brake right before applying the brake that is what his uh, reaction time depends person to person right even though some person has drunk then the reaction time will be increases and even uh, in this situation it was three meter or maybe in that situation if the person is drunk in this situation it will be maybe somewhere around 10 meter or maybe more of that so that was three meter and after the brakes are applied it travel 18 meter so overall distance travel will be nearly about 12 meter I hope this is clear to you guys. Thank you for watching. Please like this video or subscribe the channel if you find it worth for you, helpful for you. Okay. Thank you guys.